So we are driving up to uh, go to a mink farm. We need a new mink to breed to my little female digit. Uh, we don't have any buck mink right now. Um, I raised a little buck this spring that was just awesome, amazing little buck. His name was Tate. Um, but uh, Tate unfortunately was hit by a car about a month ago, well a little more than a month ago. And um, that was a devastating loss to us. But um, So we, uh, because of that, we're in need of a new new buck to breed to my little female digit. So we're driving up to the meat farm right now. And uh, we're gonna try something new. We're gonna try a uh, testing method. We want to uh, pick the very best mink we can to use for breeding. And so we're gonna try a, an experiment using some uh, lures, rabbit hide lures, and see if we can decipher which mink uh, would potentially make the best father for our next litter of babies. We spent the better part of the day testing various buck mink trying to find one that fit our goals. We wanted a buck that showed a lot of interest in our little rabbit hide lure, one that was very tenacious and had an obviously high prey drive. After looking at a large number of bucks and testing them on their prey drive with the rabbit hide lure, we finally found one that we thought we liked. He was quick, athletic, small, and very interested in the rabbit hide lure. He would latch onto it and not let go. So finally, we decided he was the one we wanted and put him in our carry box, ready for home. As we were about to leave, the mink farmer said, You know, I've got one more mink you ought to look at. He's a little older than you want, but I think he'll fit your goal. So we took a look at one more mink. I was, I was glad we were able to save him. You know, she had such a bad time and had to give him some yeah. shots. And... Look at this little guy. Ooh, he's going to get me. He's going to get me. <laughs> You're making me look like a wuss. Hey there. Hey there. He's insane. Hey there. You think it's because he's thin or is this just how he is? No, that's he's thin. Well, he was, he was very aggressive during breeding last year. You know what I mean? Yeah. Very you grab aggressive. Grab on that glove, Joe. Like, it'd be interesting to see his teeth. It wouldn't surprise <laughs> me if he had some stubby teeth and he had to cut some. You know what I mean? Yeah. But he bred a lot. He's a really good breeder and, um, didn't mind doing the dirty work. I don't think he mind anything. Jeez. I like I this little guy. That'd be pretty bad if that was on your hand. I <laughs> like you know, he came down over time, wouldn't he? I think he would. Yeah. Like I said, he, he just Look had, at that. Look at that bulldog. Balls. Look at that bulldog. This is game bred mink. <laughs> Look at that sucky. Come on, buddy. We want the glove back. Let me look at your teeth while you're doing this. Oh, he's got he's got some chips at the bottom. I do, yeah. He's got big top canine, good cop canines. Now you're not supposed to be doing this to us. We we already picked the one we're buying. Little crazy buck. I know. We should give him the rabbit. Yeah. Didn't tell me I had an insane glow over here. <laughs> <laughs> oh! Yeah. Look at that! Holy cow! Did he change grips? He switched grips and dug deep and jumped back in like a split of a second. Man, I don't want this little guy. You say he's the meanest on the farm? Oh, by a mile. <laughs> he's got sick. He's got skinny. When you got them all, because you get them about this thin for breeding, right? Yeah. Well, they're, most of them were that, like that when they're this thin? Um, they get they get meaner. A lot of them can't get that thin without dying. Oh, yeah? You know, because of the fatty liver, kind of like I was telling you. Yeah. Because you, you, you just can't get them off feed, but we try to get them thin. But these are, gosh, here's some other old males. Look at that. that. Peter's had a hard time getting weight off. They had pit fights for me. <laughs> they we have a winner here. He shows no sign of tire here. No, he does not want to quit. He's not even. Oh man. I don't know, Cade, though. What would you sell him for?
Look at the muscles. Look at his muscles. It? I'm thinking about it. It's kind of dumb, but I'm thinking about it. Oh, he seems. You think he'd? You well, think he's small? He can honestly, Joe. He can do more good for you than me. Do you think he'd? Um, we just saved his life. That's what we did. Well, that's what I'm worried about too, though. Is if he's got that? If that's if that's uh, no, if, not for him, but if that's something he just has a weak immune system, pass it on to no, the kid. I think what it was was no, he got infectious. Oh. Free. You know, mm -hmm. contact because he had a he had a leg. Look at his front leg. Mm -hmm. He had a paw that was his front leg that was as big around as his neck. And then um, <laughs> they put antibiotic in the feed, kind of cleaned that up. And he had a he had a rough fall, but he he's an old mink. I don't I don't think he'd worry about the immune system. I mean, you can see his kid. How old is he? Is he three or four or what is he? He just is going into his second year. Second year. Well, he could pretty easily carry him over the car. Yeah. He could be waiting for him to get off at the car. <laughs> you know what? I, I gotta put some thought into this. No, what, I've like, never seen a mink like that. Like I said, he's worth more than you than me. Well, well, let's look how big his kits. Did they come out about average size, below average, above average? Okay. I'll just bring my little <laughs> arm <laughs> ornament over. About normal day, we. They were fat and fat. I mean, he's the reddest of the bunch. What do you think? Because my little female's a demi. Is he, she's just going to throw all demis, right? Uh -huh. She's pure demi. You, yeah, it's the first year. Then if you bred those back. Yeah, then they come yeah, out. Then they come out like this. Because I, I don't really care what color they come out. I was just curious. I, I care. This is what I care about. Yeah. I don't care what color they are. Okay. They could be pink with polka dot for all I care. Pink with polka dots. Shut up, dude. Polka dots. Pink with polka dots. No, but if he's worth anything to you, I'm I'm good with about anything on that. He's just an old mink, and I'm glad he made it. Now, you think he'd be too hard on a real small one? Not if you not if you work him, calm him down. You wouldn't want to throw him in there today. Yeah, obviously she yeah. wouldn't be ready today, even if yeah. I wanted to. Well, I wonder if you could get him to the point where you got a harness on him, take him for a big long walk before he does. Well, we could wear him out. For real. Yeah. You think that would be advantageous? That's all it takes. Because, like I said, he was a really good breeder. He was somewhat aggressive. You know but, what I mean? But he wasn't overly. No, good. he never killed any. Because if they kill me, they're done. I skin yeah. him that day. Oh, don't hurt your teeth, buddy. You're getting into. Oh, I just. You shake that head. I know, he's like it. a pit bull. It's like I got a little little mm -hmm. stretched out pit bull mm -hmm. here. All the muscles in his head. I know, I'm watching you him know. quiver. Yeah. Still got the thick neck. Like I probably would have pelted him if I if it, when we pelted he was looking fine, acting like this. Mm -hmm. That's why I didn't kill him pelting time. I thought, well, you're good enough, dude. You keep your hand. He you earned your stripes last year. That's uh I don't know. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to, what are you thinking, Kay? Do you th think he's it. too much? Or are you thinking you don't know we should take him? I've never seen a mink like that. You say we take both of them? Yeah, I like his shake. What's yeah. you saying, babe? Both of them? He's so cute. <laughs> I, I, I'm going to have to pray about it. I can't decide on my own. can't decide on your own. Well, I, I can, but just not at this moment. I'm going to just let him have the glove. Yeah, I, I'm not worried about that. Let me... He looks like he wants to take it somewhere. Oh, he does. Here, let's pull this. Can you uh, throw it? <laughs> He's attacking the box. Are you filming this? Yes. <laughs> this is a mean SOB meat. Oh, 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 oh
Oh, he's climbing. Oh, oh. They're out the claw. Oh, the door shut. We're just trying to pick it somewhere, though. Let's open this door and see if he'll cash. <laughs> oh, he's got all the gloves. Crap. <laughs> Switch and grab my hand now. There you go. <laughs> yeah, I don't think there's any point messing around. Let's just take it. You glove. <laughs> I don't think you can find any gamer in that. Yeah. Woo! Woo! <laughs> switch grips. Now he's got me. He's gonna switch and grab my bare hand. And then I'll be stuck because he's not letting go and he grabs flesh, right? Okay, let's get a glove instead. Whew. It's so scary because he switches so fast. Yeah. Okay, big guy. Little guy. <laughs> Here, you can't have the glove, but you do need to go in the box. In the box, there we go, in the box. In the box, you can have the flare if you want. Oh, it's getting stuck. Okay. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> okay, got it. <laughs> 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 I was like, started reaching for him, and then I'm like, wait, I got a bare hand. Let's move the oof. You won't switch grips. Oh, um, don't break his teeth. I know, be careful. Okay. Let's just let him get bored. Okay, we just picked us a new mink. 